Welcome to this transformative self-coaching program designed to help you integrate and heal the pattern and beliefs of jealousy. This is an emotional EMDR mini course whose goal is to guide you through a process of understanding, reframing, and building resilience to this pattern and beliefs. It is recommended that you use this program in full screen mode, while sitting still and upright. Follow the movements of the ball or pattern on the screen with your eyes. As the words from the audio are spoken, notice the feelings they evoke in your body and any mental images that may arise. If your mind starts to wander, gently redirect your focus back to the moving ball or pattern. Optionally, or if you are not able to use video, you can also tap on one or more EFT points. How it works. In step one, we evoke the distressful emotional state of the belief or pattern. Note. This can be emotionally triggering. Take full responsibility for your well-being. In step 2, we offer ourselves loving, compassionate self-acceptance for this state and beliefs. We then reframe the belief, pattern or state with new positive suggestions to the mind. We then bridge the mind into the new, more positive reality. We finally express gratitude for the new positive reality, taking it as fact. Ready. Section 1. Unpacking Emotional Experiences. We begin with a setup of the issue. Even though I struggle with this pattern, I choose to still deeply love, honor and accept myself, and I am open to a more empowering state of being. Take a deep breath. I feel a deep sense of jealousy when I see others achieving what I desire. It hurts when I perceive someone as having a better life than mine. I often feel inadequate when comparing myself to others. Jealousy consumes me when I think about my peers' successes. I'm tormented by the thought that I might never achieve what others have. Feeling jealous makes me resentful and angry towards others. I struggle with self-worth when I see others excelling. The jealousy I feel reminds me of past failures. I fear I'll always be in the shadow of others' accomplishments. This jealousy makes me feel isolated and alone. I get anxious thinking about how much more others have achieved. It's hard to feel happy for others because of my jealousy. Jealousy makes me doubt my abilities and talents. I feel stuck in a cycle of jealousy and self-doubt. I'm worried my jealousy will prevent me from realizing my own potential. Section 2. Feel into this balanced compassionate perspective from your inner coach. Maintain your attention on the EMDR screen, following the movements of the shape or pattern with your eyes. I lovingly acknowledge my feelings of jealousy, understanding they stem from my deep desires. I gently accept the hurt from perceived inequalities, recognizing it as a part of my human experience. I compassionately hold space for my feelings of inadequacy, knowing they do not define my worth. I warmly embrace the jealousy I feel about others' successes, seeing it as a reflection of my ambitions. I kindly observe my torment over possibly not achieving as others have, understanding this as part of my journey. I compassionately recognize my resentment and anger as natural reactions to my feelings. I lovingly accept my struggles with self-worth when seeing others excel, seeing it as a call for self-love. I gently hold my memories of past failures, understanding they are steps in my growth. I lovingly acknowledge my fear of being overshadowed, knowing my path is unique. I compassionately embrace my feelings of isolation, seeing them as opportunities for self-connection. I warmly accept my anxiety over others' achievements, understanding it's a reflection of my aspirations. I kindly hold my difficulty in feeling happy for others, knowing it's a part of my emotional growth. I compassionately observe my doubts, recognizing them as invitations to rediscover my strengths. I lovingly accept my cycle of jealousy and self-doubt, seeing it as a pathway to deeper self-awareness. I gently hold my worries about jealousy hindering my potential, understanding they highlight my desire to succeed. Section 3 visualizing positive change take a deep breath i am choosing now to see my jealousy as a signpost guiding me towards my true desires and aspirations i am open to learning from the hurt i feel using it as a catalyst for my own growth and achievement i am willing to explore my sense of inadequacy 
recognizing it as a foundation for building a stronger self-image. I embrace the idea of transforming my jealousy into motivation to pursue my goals with renewed vigor. I am ready to let go of my torment, choosing instead to focus on my unique journey and its possibilities. I am shifting towards using my feelings of resentment as a mirror, reflecting areas where I can develop compassion for myself and others. I am open to the possibility of seeing my struggles with self-worth as opportunities to affirm my intrinsic value. I am prepared to view my past failures as valuable lessons, essential for my future successes. I am choosing to focus on creating my own spotlight, where my achievements shine independently of others. I am willing to consider my isolation as a sacred space for self-reflection and personal growth. I am open-minded about transforming my anxiety into a driving force for my own accomplishments. I am receptive to the idea of finding joy in others' success, as a reflection of the abundance available to all, including me. I am choosing to see my doubts as an invitation to reconnect with my unique talents and capabilities. I am ready to embrace my cycle of jealousy and self-doubt as a learning process, leading me towards greater self-confidence. I am allowing myself to perceive my concerns about jealousy as reminders to focus on my personal progress and fulfillment. Section 4. Bridging the two worlds from emotion to aspiration. Remember to maintain your focus on the EMDR screen, following the movements of the shape or pattern with your eyes. Even though I feel a deep sense of jealousy when I see others achieving what I desire, I lovingly acknowledge these feelings, understanding they stem from my deep desires, and I am choosing now to see this jealousy as a signpost, guiding me towards my true aspirations. Although it hurts when I perceive someone as having a better life than mine, I gently accept this hurt, recognizing it as part of my human experience, and I am open to learning from it, using it as a catalyst for my own growth. Even though I often feel inadequate when comparing myself to others, I compassionately hold space for these feelings, knowing they don't define my worth, and I am willing to explore this sense of inadequacy as a foundation for building a stronger self-image. While jealousy consumes me when thinking about peer successes, I warmly embrace this jealousy, seeing it as a reflection of my ambitions, and I embrace the idea of transforming it into motivation to pursue my goals with renewed vigor. Though I'm tormented by the thought that I might never achieve what others have, I kindly observe this torment, understanding it's part of my journey, and I am ready to let go of it, choosing instead to focus on my unique journey and its possibilities. Even though feeling jealous makes me resentful and angry towards others, I compassionately recognize these feelings as natural reactions, and I am shifting towards using them as a mirror, reflecting areas for self-compassion. Although I struggle with self-worth when I see others excelling, I lovingly accept this struggle, seeing it as a call for self-love, and I am open to the possibility of seeing these struggles as opportunities to affirm my intrinsic value. While the jealousy I feel reminds me of past failures, I gently hold these memories, understanding they are steps in my growth, and I am prepared to view these failures as valuable lessons, essential for my future successes. Even though I fear I'll always be in the shadow of others' accomplishments, I lovingly acknowledge this fear, knowing my path is unique, and I am choosing to focus on creating my own spotlight, where my achievements shine independently. Though this jealousy makes me feel isolated and alone, I compassionately embrace these feelings, seeing them as opportunities for self-connection, and I am willing to consider this isolation as a sacred space for personal growth. Even though I get anxious thinking about how much more others have achieved, I warmly accept this anxiety, understanding it's a reflection of my aspirations, and I am open-minded about transforming it into a driving force for my own accomplishments. Although it's hard to feel happy for others because of my jealousy, I kindly hold this difficulty, knowing it's part of my emotional growth, and I am receptive to the idea of finding joy in others' success, reflecting the abundance available to all. Even though jealousy makes me doubt my abilities and talents, I compassionately observe these doubts, recognizing them as invitations to rediscover my strengths, and I am choosing to see them as an invitation to reconnect with my unique talents. While I feel stuck in a cycle of jealousy and self-doubt, I lovingly accept this cycle, 
seeing it as a pathway to deeper self-awareness, and I am ready to embrace it as a learning process, leading me towards greater self-confidence. Though I'm worried my jealousy will prevent me from realizing my own potential, I gently hold these worries, understanding they highlight my desire to succeed, and I am allowing myself to perceive these concerns as reminders to focus on my personal progress. If you were tapping, you can stop as we go into gratitude. Section 5. Preemptive Gratitude for Transformation. I am grateful for the journey that has taught me the value of my own path, distinct from others. I give thanks for the strength I've found in embracing my emotions and growing from them. I am thankful for the clarity and self-awareness that have blossomed from my experiences. I appreciate the motivation that my feelings of jealousy have sparked within me, leading to positive change. I am grateful for the unique gifts and talents I possess, which are becoming clearer each day. I give thanks for the opportunity to transform resentment into understanding and compassion. I am thankful for the moments of self-doubt that have strengthened my self-belief and confidence. I appreciate my past, which has been a valuable teacher, guiding me to my present self. I am grateful for the realization that my achievements and worth are not overshadowed by others. I give thanks for the solitude that has allowed me to connect deeply with my inner self. I am thankful for transforming my anxiety into a powerful force for achieving my own goals. I appreciate the ability to feel joy for others, recognizing the abundance in the world and in my life. I am grateful for the doubts that have challenged me to reaffirm and reconnect with my true capabilities. I give thanks for the cycles of jealousy and self-doubt that have led to a deeper understanding and acceptance of myself. I am grateful for the realization that my potential is limitless, and my journey is uniquely mine. Section 6. Closing and Next Steps. Take a deep, rejuvenating breath. Congratulations on completing this transformative session. Take a note of how you feel in comparison to how you started, and consider journaling your notes about this session and any areas you'd like to explore. Be attentive to the potential reduction in the emotional weight of certain memories and actual circumstance shifts in your daily life. Note that it may take one, several or many uses of this program to completely clear or reframe this pattern and beliefs. This program and affirmations serve to fortify your inner journey toward a more empowered state. Feel free to revisit them whenever you need to. For more details, see the link in the bio or description 